Thanks for tuning in. In today's video, we're going to talk about how you can utilize AI in your applications, whether that's on Mac or Windows. So stay tuned for the second part as we will go to screen recording. Welcome to today's video. Um, what we're going to do with this um, bit of ChatGPT, in which we've been doing a few ChatGPT videos, is looking at sending emails to people. Um, so I've generated a list of random people and um, pretended that they owe us um, owe us money. Um, so um, for um, either products we've sold or services we've provided. Um, and what we're going to look at is where somebody has a balance due plus the due date is either today's date or earlier then we want to um, utilize um, Excel macros um, to send an email I could use mail merge but um, with word but I want to keep this all as Excel videos and see what we can utilize and whether it's possible or not so you know we had some complications in our previous video with chat GPT um, with Excel formulas which we overcame but um, yeah let's see what we can do today um, and see if it's possible um, and go from there so um, first thing we're going to do is we've we know that we've got a balance in C um, and a due date in um, D so let's go to chat GPT and let's find what is required to proceed with this so okay so what we're going to do is we're going to send emails to the people in b2 to b6 Um, the total they owe us in C2 to C6 and where the date is before t the current date today so the current day today of recording this video is the 18th of Jan 2024 so we want to only email people that owe us before today's date um, and I um, want to make sure that we also ignore people that have a balance of zero in column B um, and use the subject title in H1 um, as our template subject. Um, and finally, I want to add um, the names of the people that from A2 to A6 let's see what happens so far I can see one thing that we need to change um, and that will be the sheet we're referencing uh, just because this Excel file has multiple sheets if it was a blank um, Excel file then we would could just use the word sheet one um, so it has picked that up in point one um, also mentions about column references that's fine and Customize the email in the body section. Okay, that's good. Remember to save your workbook as a macro enabled. So excellent. Okay, and then press Alt F8 to send emails. Click run. Okay, so let's give me a few minutes and get this into um, Excel macros. 
just to um, note our sheet is called emails um, and if we go into developer mode here's visual basic just going to bring it across so here's our macro and I'm just going to pause the video while I edit this Okay, so here's our test um, macro. Um, so we've got um, our function send emails. And I just had to change this sheet um, and even put to change it here as a comment. Um, as far as um, your company name, so just Thanks from just put that in and I don't know why this didn't come up as as green, but um maybe because we there's quotes already in that line. Uncomment the line to display the email before sending. Display it. Um, just because we might have other macros in our system, I'm just going to keep this uni name unique. Okay, we're going to test this macro, so let me just quickly run this. It might have the odd error, so let's just see what happens. Okay, that didn't error out, so I will just check my emails, see what happens. Okay, attempt number two, because um, it didn't work properly. This code, um, although it runs, it doesn't send the emails. Um, and looking at references, um, we do have the modules installed um, for Microsoft Office. Um, now, if there is another module that needs to be installed, um, we can try that as well. Um, I just double check there's no Outlook ones. There is one here. Give this one more try. So go back to save, run the macro, and this. Processes, but doesn't send emails. Um, so they are not in the sent items or the outlooks on my Outlook. So on this occasion, ChatGPT has not been successful, uh, but we have had success with four other videos. Um, so if you think you know why the code doesn't work, feel free to take a snapshot of this um, and also what we had written in this text here as well. Thanks for watching and have a great day.